Look at this. I got headphones <laughs> on. I got a mic going. <laughs> Baby. Huh? If only people could see you now. <laughs> hey, no video. We've gone through this before. All right, no all video. right, all right. <laughs> Welcome to This Commerce Life. This is a podcast aimed at small, medium entrepreneurs focused on commerce. I'm Phil, your host, and Kenny, your co-host, will join us as well. And we're going to talk to you about the world of retail and commerce and how things are changing in the world. God, I set this. This is your world, man. You got to set up all this shit. (laughs) All my job is is just to kind of be there. I got not really no purpose. It's true, it's true, it's you got true. all the big jobs, buddy, and that, that you felt a little bit. I think this is like the third or fourth weekend in a row where you're uh, struggling. I'm Mike's not, not ready, on. Right? Headphones not on. Yeah. Are you hearing anything? Yeah, I don't know. Oh crap! Where are my headphones? Where's your headphones? Get organized. You know what? Well, now I don't want to screw around with it. So I got you on live speaker, so I'll just leave it there. That's fine. So yeah. I got my headphones on. I got my mic ready. Cup of coffee. Go. But, but, but I can't see you. Oh, you know why? It's probably because it's, I'm in the room upstairs and I don't have a light on. I've it's all right. No, it's all right. You can leave yourself off. Ah, just relax a second. You were just I'm giving me the gears. I had to give you some back. So. <laughs> there you go. Is that right? Well, how come my camera's not on? How do you do that? Uh, There's got to be a button here. Yeah. Oh, start there video. There you go. Hey. Oh, there you go. I can shut this off then. There you are. Look at you. Look, Look at that. Man. See, I set the bar low. I'm not supposed to be the techie. So quite <laughs> frankly, if I don't see the button, that's not my fault. It's <laughs> a general issue. What's going on, huh? Yeah. Um, what is going on? You know what? I am. Okay. So I think I've said this the last couple of, but I am busier than I've ever been before. That's good. Um, you've got a couple other people calling you probably this week. So. I, I haven't, I haven't even, I, I sent a proposal back to David. I haven't, I haven't talked to him yet again. So I don't know if that's going to pan out and I, I got to go back and talk to Aaron still. Um, I think I got something ready for him. Um, you might have another one too. Okay. Uh, so, so you know what? So I, <clears throat> So I'm I'm busier than I've ever been before. That's good. Um, the, which is really amazing. The the thing that probably um, I'm doing now. I'm just trying to make sure I'm in focus here. Um, the thing I'm trying to do now, which I hate so so much, is probably like seriously for the first time in the six months or seven months I've been in business, is I'm I'm trying to actually true up my balances and and figure out where the hell I am. Um, you know, if you're you're Canadian, like we're coming up to the end of the year, so I kind of need to make sure I got all my tax man stuff sorted out, and you know, I know how much of my liver and kidney I got to give to the tax man and all that kind of crap. Uh, you actually do all that shit. You know, I, I my wife's an accountant, right? So, so she asked me all these questions. So I'm always like, mm, I don't know. I, you know, I don't I'm, put it on a spreadsheet because you know, that's a CPA probably. She laughed at me, right? So I said, I I got a P and L, so I like I I got. I, I don't have a true p l what I have is what I have incoming and what I have outgoing and I have a sense of what you know <laughs> give or take over a month I have and it, actually i'm I'm reasonably well off i I track my mileage all that kind of crap you know and so she's kind of like where's the rest of it like I'm like what, what rest of it like <laughs> what, what else do you want <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty damn detailed like you know like, so mine's uh, an accountant too right I, you know what I, I was i was I, I have a spreadsheet that's basically just more the invoices and what GST I owe. She, where's yeah, the rest? Yeah, I don't know. Whatever. Yeah. The rest, you know what? When we sit down and do the taxes, I'll throw the rest at you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, no, it's you a know. a box somewhere. Yeah, no, I think I think because in my case, I, I, I had part of the year where I was working, I was working like I have I've income coming in from, uh, you mm-hmm. know, from, from I guess a real job, right? Like from yeah, how well, that was mine the year prior. So I get know. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This year's so, all, this year's all. All me, right? Yeah, it, it does change it. But I mean, yeah. I mean, it's really not. Think about it, we're small business. What else you got going on? If you have a shop and stuff, there's different. Yeah. But for you know, I mean, I've got the same issues you do. I've got some mileage. Yeah, I definitely have some expenses in terms of, um, you know, there has been dinners, there's been some lunches, not yeah. many. Yeah. Um, I have bought. I have to buy some stuff. Like I might buy a MacBook this week too. Mm. Mm. The new Air sounds pretty pretty as gookum. Sounds like they actually finally cleaned it up. They actually did some stuff to it. The Air. Yeah, it sounds like it. Okay. So, I mean, I might buy a few things, but quite frankly, I'm probably like you. I don't have, there's not a lot of, of stuff per se. Mm-hmm. I mean, the shop has tons of shit, mm-hmm. but this really is not that much. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. I mean, the so, good, but. 
Yeah. I, I hate doing that crap anyway. I just, oh my I, God. Just so, you know, like yesterday, yesterday was just like me looking for, you know, and, and like mm-hmm. natural accountant questions. She's like, you know, what'd you do on like, you know, maintenance on the car and how, you know, how much are we writing off of the car? I'm like, oh God. I don't, I don't know. Can't we just look at the visa receipts? We'll take a look. And, you know, like, so I'm I'm sort of I used to call like, half time. Like, well, half. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. And I'm like, uh, I don't know. I did breaks somewhere in May. Maybe I'll go. <laughs> She's like, that's, somewhere that's what in visa's May. For. You know, like, that's, you know, the accountant in her is like, what do you mean somewhere in May? I'm like, I don't know. You're lucky I remember it somewhere in May, Shit, right? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty proud of The answer was May. front half of the year, right? Like, <laughs> <laughs> right, so I don't even sometimes remember it's in the same year. Right. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I, so, I think it was this year. Find out it was last August. Yeah. The one prior to this one. I don't know what the hell year we're in. Oh my God. So, so anyway, so that's kind of like, it's been a great week and then I, I finished it or, you know, I'm finishing it Saturday, Sunday with nothing but fucking accounting. So. Yeah. That's <laughs> I hate that. I'm sorry. Like I, I, I'm, I'm like you, I, I, you know, and I think this is every every sort of business person or an entrepreneur's dread. I, I hate doing all that shit. I hate yeah. it. Like yeah. I've got to do invoicing, right? What are we on today? It's the fourth, right? I, I've got to do. I'll, I have to do it today during some of the football games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because, but I, you know what it is? Because once I start doing that, then I think, oh shit, I haven't done anything for him. Then I start looking, and I'll, four hours later, then oh, Chris, I go back to the invoices, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it, sometimes it takes like four or five days, and it's not like there's a million of them. It's not that they're complicated. Yeah. No, it's nothing. It's like literally probably half an hour worth of yeah. work. I just, yeah. to me, it's like the worst half hour. I, I hate doing it. So the, the only, so the only thing in there, so I, my next article is on like the five things that I've used to kind of make my life better. Cause I fucking hate all this stuff like you do. Um, the, the one, so I actually don't mind invoicing at all. Cause I use wave and I, I love that. it. I love it so much. It is uh, like Wave keeps track of everything. So even my HST, I don't track it anymore. All of it's in, in Wave, right? So I, when you, as soon as you um, tag and bill it in Wave, yeah. Wave buckets it all for you. So every month I check Wave to go, how much do I need to call back for HST? And then it tells me cumulatively for the year. Do you know what I mean? It's literally yeah, like two clicks it. and I'm good. So I'm, I'm so happy. I don't need to log all that bullshit. I don't need to... <laughs> <laughs> well, see, and I do. I, I like I do, yeah. I do. I do. I sit down with my my Excel invoice. Yeah, <clears throat> which is not massively complicated. It's an invoice. Yeah. Who cares? I change the numbers, change the dates. Yeah. But again, it's all stupid little things that you know. Yeah. There's programs that'll do it, but yeah. you know what it's like. And, and and you know, most most people, if they listen, if they're a small business, you have something and it works, so you don't move. Mm-hmm. Right, because it's yeah. it, and and the thing is, like, if if I would look at some of the things you tell me, I could probably save myself you know, time. Yeah. And it would be organized in a fashion that might make more sense. Now, whatever I'm doing works for me. Yeah. But it takes me more time because I have to yeah. two step things. Yeah. I take an old invoice, yeah. you know, for, for, let's say if I'm invoicing you, I take an invoice of yours. I change the, the, the invoice number yep. dates, but you know, you start doing that. You're thinking there's yep. programs to do this for you. You don't have to do this. Yeah. And in the program, you just click fill and <laughs> it populate. But why would yeah. I do that when I could do it the hard way and then piss and moan about it? Because otherwise, we don't have nothing to talk about. No, no, but 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 the it's the upfront, right? So I think the where software is getting better is you think of like early gen software. Um, so much work it, to get it in. It took you so long to get onboarded that you're kind of exactly. going, I don't no know way. This. Like, no, how am I doing this? Right? Like, yeah. so I'm in a place right now with Wave where it literally took me no time. Right? Like, it took me yeah. three. Uh, no, like, like, let's say 15 minutes to get onboarded, you know, and so I'm good, right? But if I get a move, if somebody says, hey, new software, I'll probably go, well, no. Like, I spent 15 minutes on that. I ain't spending more time, right? Like, so yeah. it is kind of that, like, when do, yeah. you, when do you know when to jump, right? Like, I think, I think you got to do it, like, on, like, you got to do, like, a Jan 1. Like, yeah. if I'm going to jump to something, yeah. I think I got to do it in January because yeah. you know, I, I don't want to have to move. You know, it's, it's like, again, it's not catastrophic, but I don't want to yep. move a hundred invoices. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't. Because like, if, I, I, if I start in there, what am I going to do for this year? Yeah. It's already started. So I have to move yeah. all the shit, yeah, shit yeah. over. I'm not yeah. doing that. Yeah. The Wave right. thing, um, you know, what I love about that too is just, uh, I guess I'm giving Wave a free plug here. but don't take um, it. I know, right? But what, what I love is they have pay portals too. Um, so some of the guys in the U.S. that I build, they can pay me by credit card. They can pay me by PayPal. It yeah. comes right through the portal. So right attached to the invoice are the click buttons that they need to uh, be able to. Okay, obviously, I'm going to have to take a look at this. Do you know one. what I mean? 
Um, and that's just wicked, you know, because sometimes like the first time I did that, we probably kicked around payment options like three times, right? Like, what about this way? What about that way? Can you EFT? Can you, you know, and they're like, no, no, no. And you're like, oh my God, you know, like, <laughs> you know, but then I found wave and like, oh, this is wicked. I can just pay it by credit card. I'm like, great, done. You know, yeah. we're out. So you know, it's, it's amazing. Okay. I guess I'll have to do that. I got, you know, it's, well, I don't want to do this today. Like I hate doing this shit. No, no, don't do it now. Wait, wait till Christmas. Huh? Wait yeah, till Christmas, like when you're off, man. It drives me crazy. Like seriously, it's it's wow. such a great it's such a great platform that um, it's, it's all good, right? It's just fucking yeah. I do this. You know, I hate admin shit, and it's funny. You know, every I've had I've had a whole this week was a week of meetings, right? Yeah. Um, actually, really good meetings. It was a good week. It was, yeah. it was a solid week. Um, but it's it, it's all the same stuff. Everybody talked to who's like in the start or in the small everything. <laughs> Everything is just so, everybody hates doing the admin. Everybody yeah. just hates it. Yeah. Because it takes so much time. Yeah. And in our country, like, I mean, you know, there's, you're worried, you got to worry about the taxes and the remittance and you're looking at this and you're looking at, what the? <sighs> yeah. Work. I know. I know. It's, uh, it's just so, it's, yeah. Anyway, so yeah. So I, you know, great week, but like terrible finish. But, yeah. but you know, you're going to do it, right? Like I, I, you know, like my wife is like, look, we're, we're probably going to want to, you know, you might have to pay taxes. I'm like, great, but I don't really want to be that far in the hole. So I guess it's November. I just got to figure out where I am. Well, so don't I worry can... about it. Once you, once you pay this year's, they look at you and say, oh, he makes a little bit of money. You know what? Quarterly. Don't worry. You'll, you'll be paying, you'll be paying regularly. Well, yeah. So I'm, I'm. Which is actually trying... sometimes better too. It's the budgeting then too, right? Yeah. Yeah. But I'm, I'm trying to stay off that radar if I can. Right. So yeah, that's not going to happen. I mean, now that I've said it on air, I'm sure, it's I'm sure the CRA is listening and <laughs> hey, listen, they're getting their money. It's not like yeah. they're hiding the taxes. What, what the hell do I care? Yeah. 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 You know, and honestly, sometimes I'm, I'm, a, I'm, you know, I sound like the old person, but you know what? The more you pay, well, hi, the more you're paying, why are you paying more? Yeah. Cause you're making more. Yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's not the, you know, yeah. I mean, that's a very Canadian thing. I mean, if we were in America, that we would be, you know, spit on and, and stepped yeah. on for saying that because yeah. the more you make, the less you should have to give to anybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. See, the Canadian way, we make more, we pay more. Yeah, okay, we pay fine. More. It's yeah. not a big deal. Yeah, I guess I have to pay. Yeah, I mean, that's what I look at. Okay, I mean, it's coming anyway. What's the difference? Yeah, all right. Well, I'm, I'm in the same boat as you. Know. You know, these, when they come, they come in. They come yeah. in hit big hits, right? Because yeah, yeah. remember, like when you were working for somebody, this was all buried. Yeah. Well, right? you paid you it every pay? month, right? You paid it every yeah. month. It came out. Sure, who's, I didn't see it. Think about it, right? Like it's. No, I, I knew I was going to get X amount of yeah. dollars every month. Yeah. Check comes in. You look at the check. Well, yeah. same, same. Yeah. And that was it. But the, but the bigger difference here is, you know, you can like some of these out, right? Like you can, you can actually go, hey, you know, what? we got an extra bill this month. If I go out and hustle and get a little more business, maybe I can offset some of that, right? So well, that's, that's what, what you can't do. do, which you can't do with a salary, right? Like the salary <laughs> is no. it, right? So, yeah. yeah. Oh, no, I wouldn't trade. I, I, I mean, this, the, nope. this is, this is yeah. definitively the way to do it. Yeah. yeah, yeah oh, yeah. yeah. Like every day, every day more that you do more on your own, like the, the, it just becomes more and more. And then, you know what is funny? You start going out for dinner, you talk to your friends, and you're thinking, my, I guess I, I guess I better say that you know what I'm really tired or life's the shits because I don't want to be Nobody the odd man. Nobody wants to hear out. that I'm happy all the time. Exactly. How do you, you like know, your job? Yeah. I'm thinking. Well, how do you like yours? Yeah. <laughs> oh, mine's terrible. Yeah, me too. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. It, it sucks. But deep down, you're thinking, "Oh my god, you can I love every minute of it." <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't. I would never go back. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, so I have yeah. thrown a few more people your way. Okay. Okay. So there's people in this country that just that basically you are the guru of SEO, digital marketing, et cetera. So you better live up to that okay. shit because I've been selling yeah. that hard. I'm, I'm, I'm working it. I'm working it. I'm, I'll, I won't, I won't ever, uh, I, I won't leave your guys. Uh, I won't leave. Oh, I'm not worried about that. Yeah, I'm sure you'll be fine. I mean, hopefully you get a few of them because you know what it is. I mean, it's, it's been really nice in this last, in this last week. You know what it's, uh, you know, you're sitting across from people that you're, you're helping, whether it's on the yep. phone or in live and you know, and I, then it's over. And I'm thinking, you know what? I'm pretty lucky because I've got some really, not some, I, all of them. They're all, I've got to work with, work with really, really good, nice people. Mm -hmm. Like really, like, I mean, it's just, they're just really nice people. They're trying hard. You know, it's just, yeah, it's, it's, it, it is. It's pretty like cool. What else right? can you ask for, right? 
It's pretty cool though, you know, because you yeah. think about it. Like in the old days, like when you were on the desk at, at uh, Target, yeah. or I'm at London, is that for the most part, like literally for the most part of London, they were all fantastic for yep. the most part. Yep. But there's a lot of times where you just didn't really want to be with that person. Didn't want to have. And I don't have any of that. Yeah, Most no, I don't. Them, I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't yeah. work with you. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. That's that's the beauty. Is that basically, you know, if I didn't like Phil, I just don't work with Phil. That's it. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, whatever. I think you know, and and the other part of that, I think that's really cool. Is I mean, even the guys that you've sent me so far is all of them are in this like just phenomenal. They're great space. They're great spaces and they're literally businesses that, you know, with a little bit of push, a little bit of, um, you know, whatever it is, like the magic that you and I provide. I think know, we could kill it. Like, I was requiring stuff today. Growth, right? Like it's just. 100%. There's yeah. no, there's, they're all at a point. Like a couple of them are at a point where, you know, over the years, the brand they may have purchased has hit the mm-hmm. skids. Mm-hmm. But there's so much uphill potential yeah. or the other ones are just starting up or, you yeah. know, relatively new and all you can see is the sky. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Right. I mean, I don't know where the ceiling is on these ones yeah. yet. Yeah. And really the ceiling is, I mean, I had, I talked to one yesterday. You're going to get a call from them too. Um, but it's a, it's a small Haba company in the interior. And oh, yeah, you were talking just, about these guys. Yeah. Again, you know what? It's, it's, it's just, you'll, you'll love them mostly because they're just, they're just good people. Like yeah. they're just really good people. Yeah. But when you look at their brand, they're doing well. They're doing well. I mean, they know what they're doing. They yeah. just need a few um, pointers on how to do it maybe a little yeah. differently. It's going yeah. to be better, but I don't want to say better because it sounds like we're smarty pants. It's, it's not about that. I mean, there, be, there is a better way to do it because okay. there's yeah. the right, there's not the right way. Yeah. It's, there's a better way to do it. Yeah. It's kind of like optimizing the business. Really. It is. Right. Yeah. So, you know, yeah. they've got a business that's X amount of dollars and quite frankly, if they really think it through and manage the growth, they, they could they could double it in two years, three years, easily, easily, without doing much of anything, and probably barely feeling the the stress and the pains of it. Right, dude. Those and, are like that's, but that's amazing business, right? Like that is. But that's also because yeah. there's people like us where I'm telling them, listen, of my opinion, I wouldn't go here. I would yeah. go here. Yeah. And here's the reason I would do this one. This one's a little easier or whatever it is, right? Yeah. Or less costly. Yeah. So with, listen, let me ask you, some of your small guys, I've been trying to allocate uh, sort of what I think they need to do for marketing um, as a percentage, you know, because that's yeah. how we have to work because we're old buyers. So everything's on a percentage. So I'm trying yeah. to go back. I'm thinking, okay, if they spent on every SKU they had, let's say about 15%, off their cost for um, um, marketing. And marketing could be obviously whether it's digital, whether it's some yep. print, radio, et yep. cetera. Yep. What are you, are you allocating a percentage with them? Um, let's say um, yeah. the, 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 the dog uh, feet ones, Muck, yep. the right? Not yeah, yeah, Mutlucks. Yeah. Mutlucks. Yeah. Uh, is that, is that, is that sort of what you're trying to do as well? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. 12 to 15 is usually of their cost. It used to be, yeah, it used to be 10, and then, you know, as you get into it, like when it was just Facebook and Facebook was kind of economical, you go yeah. 10 is enough, but it isn't anymore. And you've got to be able to do Google and all those other things. So I, I say 12 to 15%. Usually they wind up at 10 or they, you know. I figure 10 is going to be it because yeah. not every SKU is going to get advertised and you're going yeah. to advertise it over yeah. blah, 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 yeah. right? Yeah. So no, I'm trying to figure out a percentage too because I want to allocate. You, you want to be safe. Right. Yeah. And because a lot of them aren't even considering, like they're not even considering um, shipping costs to get to no. a warehouse, whether it's yeah. an Amazon warehouse or whether it's, um, you know, Phil's warehouse. Yep. Right. So I'm, I'm yep. even, even going down to that level these days and saying, okay, listen, now allocate 7%. I mean, I know it's going to be high. Yeah. But if your model is built on worst case scenario and looks good, I mean, really, where are you going to end up? Yeah. 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 No, I agree. I agree. Yeah. Yeah. So 12 to 15 is what I recommend normally. Okay, you're still that high, that too. You're like yeah. me. Yeah. Okay. Well, I yeah. kind of thought that's where it was going to sit at, but yeah. Um, I was going to ask you. So the um, the guys that do that thing for the socks. Do you have any interest in talking to them? Like they're looking for people that can help them get the into socks. retailers, or these are the guys that have that product that keeps your socks together right through the washer to the dryer. I think that's pretty cool. It's you know, yeah. the, ch- the only challenge these guys are going to have is you got a really really short window. 
right? So if anybody's out there, you know, if anybody listens, right, and wants, like, if you come up with a really cool idea that's product, like this one's yeah. specifically a product, yeah, right? And it's not got a massive barrier to entry, which I don't think this one probably does, unless there's patents all over, which most likely there's not. Yeah. By the time you, 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 you really start thinking through too much, yeah. it, it may be over. Like you've got to just, if it's cool, yeah. pounce. I don't mind helping them. I mean, I don't know yeah. what I can do for them though. Like I don't if, know. Are they, like, if they're looking more... to get into accounts, I, yeah. I talk to Luke. And the oh, reason okay. I would talk to Luke, that's what Luke okay. does all day. Okay. Luke is always in accounts. Okay. If they're looking for, you know, the marketing help, but be more you, if, if they want to help with, with sort of what I think they could cost it at, what they want to go at, yeah. I have no problem helping them. They just have to yeah. send me some, or I'll talk to them. It takes a yeah, couple yeah, minutes. Yeah. not a big deal. Yeah. I don't, mind, I don't mind giving them, you know, a little bit I'll of free talk time. To Luge. I, I've kind of got them there. So I need, I need, uh, they want, I know you, did. That's like, what you, hey, did. you want to wrap me? And I was like, no, I don't. No, 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 <laughs> no interest. Thank I'm you. Like, you no. Yeah. No interest. Okay. Like zero. Okay. Okay, okay. Well, yeah, like zero. I have no interest in doing the repping part. But again, Luch would be okay. Uh, yeah. I'm trying to think. Because yeah. uh, you want someone that actually goes um, goes across the country. You know, I'm set up. It's it's early right now. No, that's okay. That's okay. Yeah, we'll, there's we'll definitely continue. people. I mean, I, again, I think because Luch is going to be doing pink anyway. Yeah. It's probably within the sort of the same buyer realm. It is actually. Same space. Yeah. So, yeah. so it could, it, luckily, it might even be the same buyers. Yeah. 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 Right. Okay. Okay. But he's got, this person has got to go pretty quickly. Yeah. Yeah. In my opinion. I mean, I don't think that, I don't think this is like a, this is not a 10 year product. Oh no, no, no. Right. I think yeah. this one is one of those ones that if it hits, it's yeah. going to, it's going gonna, it's gonna to probably hit. got like a year, maybe 18 months, you know, yeah, maybe two years on the high side. Yeah. 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 yeah right. Yeah. Like if you can get through, like if you can get some stuff this Christmas, it'd be great because next Christmas might happen. Yeah. Might not. Yeah. Yeah. I agree. Yeah. So I, I do that. I, I would, I yeah. would, uh, I, I would push it off to Luch. Yeah. Okay. And if Luch doesn't want to do Luch, I'll know people. I'm just trying to think yeah, who yeah. else I, if, I, think, yeah. I can't think of a bloody name in my head. This it's okay. It's 7am over there. No, it's eight o'clock in a sense, right? Because we went back. Yes, it is. Isn't that true? Like I got an extra hour of sleep. Yeah. 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 That's why I stayed that up until 30 working on spreadsheets because yeah. I knew I had an extra hour. <laughs> that was pretty sweet to get the extra hour. We need, we need daylight savings every week. Yeah, we should do this For, weekly. But I think yeah. I still don't understand why we're doing this. I mean, the Everest, it was bright in the morning. Yeah. Right? I don't know. See, to me, honestly, I don't mind waking up. I hate coming home. I don't like coming home in the dark. Yeah, like, yeah. I don't want it four o'clock now to be black yeah. as night. I, I yeah, don't it's crappy. It's crappy. So I would, I, I'm okay if this was actually the times. I would, I'm okay if this was a 820. Yeah. And it was dark. Yeah. It's, I, I don't care. Yeah. No, I'm with you. I'm with you. I don't so, understand why we do this thing. I don't know. I, I don't get it. I don't get it. I've, I've looked into it before, but uh, I just, I don't get it. So I just, whatever. whatever. Let it go. Yeah. yeah. So what, go. what, uh, what were you doing this week? Lots of meetings? <laughs> Lots of little meetings. I mean, we had, I've had some, I had some planning sessions and things like that, but a lot right. of little meetings at the shop with, again, it's just a few really neat little brands, right? Yeah. 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 A couple of uh, them have been just basically, I think I'm on hour probably three or four of, of help. <laughs> It's going to be worth nothing to me, but quite frankly, it's, it's, it's awesome for them. So I'm, I'm looking at it thinking, well, you know what, as long as one person wins and the other person really didn't lose, ah, whatever, <laughs> right? Not that big a deal. Not that big a deal. No, and again, want, the person's like just such a wonderful person. I think that ah, gives a shit. Yeah. 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 Yeah, right? yeah. I'm hoping she'll, uh, she'll do well. It's a really cool little product. It's called, um, it's a, it's a, an all natural, uh, psoriasis eczema. Okay. Uh, type cream. Oh, cool. It is cool. It's really that's nice. Cool. It's well made. It's clean. Yeah. And she's just like a really, I, she's just really cool. I mean, I, I, you know what it is? It's, it's, like, it's what, I, don't, I don't know if you notice it or, and it is going to put on back to our sexist, racist kind of world that we tend to gravitate to as marketers. I kind of like the fact that lately, like a lot of the people I've been dealing with have been these, 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 these women who started in these companies and like are fucking crushing it. Like, even if they're not killing it in sales yet, like you're just looking, they're going to kill it. Yeah. They're going to kill it. Yeah. Just, yeah. They're going to kill it because it's, it's the thought, well, everything, it's just the thought process is thoughtful, well thought. It's just so, you're thinking like, holy shit, man. When the, when the rubber hits the road, this thing is going to move. Like, it's awesome. It, 
I, but you know, like this is back to, this is, this is why we're in this space, right? Because like you, the truth is between us, we, we know enough big companies that if, if I wanted to go and get a cushy, not cushy, um, if you're a consultant, you're listening and you have one of these, I'm not accusing you of being cushy, but if I wanted to get a job with law blahs or, uh, P and G or J and J or, you know, as a consulting gig that was really safe and made me lots of consulting dollars, that's great. Right. But you're talking about shaving, like, you know, there, they're talking about like SharePoint growth or like SharePoint maintenance or like, how do I get an extra point exactly. of volume? But these guys are like, you're literally like some days I come out of there going, holy crap, like you're going to double or triple your business, right? Like there's yeah. no, you like know, like Muntlux. Muntlux was like that. Muntlux is like, I, I think, I think we're going to like, you know, grow another 30%. I'm like, are you crazy? Like you could easily double your business, right? Like this is, it's not even a thing, right? It's, it's going to happen, right? Like, well, and the thing is, that's a part, yeah. like it's not even one where you're kind of bullshitting. You're thinking like, holy shit. Like I hope you can actually maintain the growth. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Because this thing could, this thing could literally double. Yeah. And, yeah. Uh, I'm trying to write the, the product. It's Satya, S-A-T-Y-A. Okay. You gotta go take a look at it. I, I really like it. I think it's just a really cool product. And her name is Patrice. And she's just wonderful. Like she really is. She's just like a, just a really it's S A T Y A dot C A. Oh, organic um, skin. Organic skincare. Okay. Like it, but it, it's just like a, it's a good, it's a neat product. And it's packaged well. And she's so like she's vibrant and she's excited. And you know, she's a mom who had the kids got like I guess some eczema. So she yeah. develops a product for it and she's developed a, like a really nice product. I think I've sent her your way too. And I told her that just so you know, like I always tell people the same thing. I said, he's really nice. And you know what? You could probably get a half an hour out of him. And he won't even notice and you'll get some help. Yeah, I said, yeah, then if you hire him, it's great. But if not, don't worry, but he's not going to really care. He's just as stupid as I am. <laughs> like he'll just do things for free because he's got no sense in his head, but he's a nice guy. <laughs> no, I, <laughs> I I think that's great. <laughs> no, no, but but I I am I am like that. I I don't I don't care. Like I I am. Well, I you care like I care. Like I want to get paid and I want to make money, of course. But like yeah, yeah, when you yeah. start looking at some of these lines, like you just think, man, I I just I just like to know that. I'd be it's nice to help them and just get it going. Because like you said, you know what you could and you can call it cushy. These guys who land these contracting jobs yeah. with the J and Js and. And, you know, Pfizer's, you know, $500,000, million dollar contracts, and yeah. they have a crew of 30, and they go in and talk about SharePoints. Like, really, who gives a shit? I mean, I know it's, it's a big deal, because, yeah. but there's, there's, there's no, no, there's no, there's no, you're not doing anything. No, there's no excitement there. There's, there's nothing there's in nothing. it. It's so it's clinical. Crazy. It's so yeah. calculated. When you're doing these people like yeah. this, yeah. there's so many moving parts. Like, this yeah. is, you know, and this actually makes a difference in people's lives. Oh my God, this stuff's really nice. Isn't it nice? Yeah. She's done a good job with her website. Oh, she's done an awesome job. I think her website is nice. The she's pictures really are good. nice, right? You know, she's like yeah. another Shanine and all these, these, these young people are just, you know, like just get it, right? Just crazy good. I love it. Crazy good. Oh yeah, look at that. She's got 3,000 followers. Wow. Again, though, you know what it is? So, so on something like this, this is sort of what I'm asking because this is getting really specialized. Yeah. It, you know, and, and again, what I worry about with some of these guys is that I'm, I'm, I'm really trying, with, not about in a good way, like I'm trying to dissuade them from direct to mass. Yeah. And I told them, I said, you know what, on some of these ones. It'll suck the life out of you. Yeah. So I'm saying your yeah. online sales are your personal online sales if you can manage it. Maybe do the website in the Shopify, but find a 3PL, like a pick a pack, um, and let them do the shipping. And you'll still do way better than you would probably on Amazon, right? The difference yep. with Amazon, obviously, is you've now got an audience the size of the planet. Yeah. But just build in the fact you're probably off your retail, you're going to lose 45% of it. Not a big deal because in the real world, the retailer is going to take 40% of that anyway. Yeah. And then you were working backwards from there. So it's a wash. Actually, yeah. you're probably positive. But, uh, you know, I said, you know, using a distributor is not necessarily the worst thing, you know, nope. and maybe looking at a, a salesperson, you know, like, like we talked about, sort of like, um, like Jim and Lori or whatever, like where they're, they're yep. willing to do the work and the hustle in the, um, yeah. in the natural health kind of space. But I just think this product's awesome. But I worry about, I wouldn't want this in a shopper's uh-uh. uh, tomorrow morning, uh-uh. right? Because shoppers would kill it would be kind of terrible, actually. It'd be a death. 
but I think yeah. they could go into, um, again, I hate, you know, I shouldn't say this out loud. I mean, I can't stand McKesson, but let's say it was going into a McKesson and it was going to be serviced uh, through them. It's not that I, I like the stores they service. I don't like them, but I mean, who cares? They're such yeah. a mother. So I, I mean, they're, they're kind of, they're, they're kind of like this necessary evil almost. Yeah, I know, but they're like a dictator. I just don't like that kind of, you want to find someone who you can work with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not that I'm working for, but the, the stores they service, like they service so many independents that I think that's where this belongs, sort of in the natural health channel, or if it goes into drug, calculated. You know, if you're going to do uh, pharmacies or Rexalls in your guys' world, it's that, lo- that location yeah. where you know the pharmacist or the staff are like on these categories. Yeah. And you can actually, you know, you can actually do what you want to do, which is get this product to, to, families who are looking for an alternative to some of the harsh or old OTCs that we would have peddled in the old yep, days. For sure. For sure. I'll probably, honestly, we, we still have, we had really bad eczema um, as ki- like our kids did. Um, now it's all under control, but I'll probably order some of this anyway. Honestly, uh, you, know, you, should do, you should order it, but you should actually reach out to her. I'll tell you what, yeah. I'll send her the, um, I think I've, I've sent her um, um, your contact information okay. anyway. Okay. But if you reached out to her and told her you were talking to me, like, again, I just, you know, it's, it's one of those ones that you just, it's just, it's just the right people to help. Yeah. It, yeah. So just, free plug for these guys. Um, we just followed them on this commerce life on Facebook, but it's Satya organic skincare. So you can find uh, Satya is S A T Y A organic. .ca. Um, dot C A. And, um, there's just like, wow. and Patrice, I think actually does the video right at the front there. It's got a really nice little okay. webpage and, and like I said, she's just a wonderful person. Like you just, yeah. yeah. Even if you don't have eczema, you should just buy it. Yeah. yeah just yeah, buy it. You know why? It's such a really nice product. It's a nice pack. You can use it for anything you want. Yeah. It's multi-purpose. It's just super healthy it. for you. Like there's some really good stuff in this. Yeah. Look at the reviews yeah. even. I know. Like seriously. I know. Like it's, it's she, like she's actually, she's, she's actually really killing it. Yeah. She right? really is. So really, again, what I was trying to do is help her again with the costing. And the retails, don't give it away. This is what I would do. But, you know, the usual yeah. stuff we do. But Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, that's amazing. Who, and, you know, and you know the manufacturer. This is our, our friend who plugs or helps me like perpetually. Yeah. <laughs> Should we give ProLab and Linda another plug? Linda. What, the, is this six straight episodes or seven now? I, I don't know, it's like a million. I think Linda owns this freaking webpage. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, man. This podcast is all about Linda. This podcast is owned and produced by Linda Webb. <laughs> yeah. and, and our friends at ProLab. Honestly. You know what? That's it. No more Linda Webb. That's it. No more Linda Webb. We've got to plug somebody else now. Oh, no. We're plugging other people, too. No, I love Linda. I've got to keep plugging Linda. That's <laughs> the difference. We can't. Linda, don't leave us. No, geez, please don't do that. My God. <laughs> Family's got to eat. Ah, it's so good it's anyway, so awesome oh man and i think you will like i'm hoping um i'm hoping aaron um i hope we can do some stuff for aaron because yeah. i honestly think that there, um yeah. between the quest and the nature's harmony like i think there's um it's it's a hard category so but if he would kill it he's um so he's spending i won't say how much right but because i shouldn't i don't want to give away no. his marketing budget but he's spending a shit ton of money on socials like he sent me the numbers he was spending but his followers like he you know he spent it's enough content to get, yeah he well he spent enough to get a hundred thousand impressions yeah but his followers are still stuck at like 500 yeah i right? talked to him the other day about like it three or four months in a row and i said to him I think they got this all wrong. Like they, they're just not like they're blasting it, but they're not tuning to your audience. Like this is not your audience, right? Like, you know, it's kind of like throwing flyers at a hundred thousand random people when all you need is, you know, um, a 16 year old, you know what I mean? Like, like it's just, totally. it's, it's the totally, but this is a game yeah. where small business needs to pay attention to things, yeah. right? What, yeah. what happens at the end of the day, it's not so much how much you spend, yeah. it's where you spend it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah. Like the, and this is, a, this, yeah. is a, this is, you know, I mean, it's, it's a line that has heritage. Yep. The packaging is quite nice. Yeah. Right? And, and on this one, I think what he needs to do is, I know they're spending, I don't know what they're doing, but they're spending a lot of money on, on the social and the, and the marketing aspects, but he's not spending enough and even in trade. 
Oh. And you know as well as I do, on some of these lines like this, you know, no, he's got he's such great. he's got a lot yeah. of really good independent retailers that are supporting them. Yeah. But I yeah. don't think we're supporting them as much as we could. So like I now I'm going through and doing ad grids for let's say the top ten chains. Yeah. Yeah. And the top fifteen or twenty independents. Yeah. And I just think by just even giving them a little bit, it doesn't have to be a ton of money, but I think we I think we can actually double just doing that. Then if you get, you yeah. know, cool content and get consumers thinking, wow, I really need this. Yeah. It's, it's a well, whole different game, right? Yeah. It's funny because he and I talked about, and so I, I think I'm, I'm working to, without actually talking to you about this, but, but uh, I think I'm working to free up cash so you can spend some trade money. Cause I said to him, this is too much money. Like we, you know, w- with your audience base, we could easily spend, you know, like 50 bucks, right? Yeah. Um, and really target an audience and then show you some audience growth. Like, so you need, you need likes, you need fans, you need followers before you start dropping, you know, like obscene, like he's borderline obscene on the, on the social spending, right? Like it was just like, this is so excessive for how much, you know, you could do. Um, anyway, yeah, I, I was kind of blown away. I was, I was like, this is too much money. Like if you're doing this now, whether it's with me or somebody else, you should stop it. Like yeah. you're not, you're chucking money into a bucket. Like the difference between old world um, marketing and new world marketing is like old world, you would spend what he's spending in proportion on like a commercial that nine months from now you would know whether it worked or not. Yeah. But in, in new world socials or, or media, like if you don't, if you don't see it in a month, if you don't see action like clicks and click throughs and you know, all that kind of stuff, you should stop it because you got the wrong audience. You got the wrong message, right? Like, you know, you know, you know, right away whether it's working or not. Right. So, but you, you know what they, yeah. what, what they do is, is a lot of times what they look at it in terms of an absolute number, it doesn't appear to be a big number. Yeah. Right. And, and the biggest thing the small business is measure. Yeah. Right. You spend, you just look, you go, yeah, next. And you're yeah. thinking, no, breathe. Yeah. breathe. I'm going to send you Patrice's contract info. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. So anyway, I mean, that one's interesting, but um, trying to figure out how to help him. He needs help, but he needs, he needs really cost of effective help, right? Cause he's got such a small audience that um, yeah. what he needs, yeah. he just needs some love, some TLC to get yeah. you know the thing moving. But that means not spending a ton of cash, just enough to get it moving yeah. before, you know, you worry yeah. about it. No. And to me, honestly, I think the sort of what you just said, I think he needs to do it more in, um, um, he, he needs to do more in, in, in trade right now. Yeah. 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 And you know, me and you, yeah. like I'm not in today's world, yeah. you know, you should be able to do a lot more direct to consumer. Yeah. But the fact is it's, it's, it's a tough category on a good day anyway. Yeah. And quite frankly, right now, I think what you need is more pickup on shelf yeah. or wherever that is. And then if anything, um, leveraging that and having uh, maybe some more brand advocates or something or something to that effect. Yep. Like, and work the other side of it that yep, yep. way, but this yep. hunt for people. Yeah. And like, like you said, it's, it's like a fishing line in the ocean. Yeah. I mean, come on guys. I mean, it's one little hook. I mean, it's a, it's a big ocean. Yeah. Like you got to target a little cleaner. Yeah. 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 Right. Yeah. Yeah. For sure. But for that's sure. hard. That's a typical small business. Yep. Um, yeah. That's a typical small business issue, right? It's, yeah. Um, I, uh, I have pictures for you. Uh, let me see. Where did I put them? I wanted to show you these cause I had some stuff done. Um, crap. Where did I put them? Maybe I left them in there. Yes, I did. Okay. Hold on. Let me, uh, I gotta, I'm gonna flip on my screen for a second. Um, so you can see, okay, <clears throat> sorry. I'm just, I'm trying to, uh, okay. Yeah, this is what I want. Okay. So hold on. Let me share, share screen. Can you see that? Oh, look how cool that looks. Yeah. So this is my girl. So Sarah Carvello free plug for her. She oh, is, uh, Sarah, she's an ex hubba. She is, but Sarah is like this magician with a, with a, um, with a nice. camera. Um, yeah. I mean, look how cool that looks like. Seriously. Yeah. She looked, she took some serious, like, nice, 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 nice. See, this is where, Oh, I got to get you Amazon, right? Yes. Yes, please. 
Okay, I will try to remember when I hang up the phone with you now. Yeah, see this one, this one's the one I have. I think I, I posted it. That's Instagram. funny. Like and honestly, but, see yeah. it, you know, we're looking at okay, so because if you and I end up having conversations by ourselves, right? Remember, this yeah. is not you know so we're looking at my on I, sometimes like I do I, I hang up because what'd you talk about? I said I, I well the rest of the world has no freaking clue. Phil and I knew what we were talking about. No, we actually no, no. The the world has a. I mean, you know, there are like five followers out there that have clues on what we're doing. And Linda Webb, because Linda Webb runs the show. <laughs> you know, between, between us, we totally know what's going on. So, but the pictures are of my of the Commercial Drive Coffee Company. Uh, yes, bags. Oh, it's yeah. really awesome. So yeah. I'm surprised you don't like the drive. No, I, I don't no. drink the. I don't drink these filled espresso. So I, I drink. Um, the, I drink like the this drive. one, right? You're talking about that's one. Yeah, I, that's, that's I, I ordered that one. I meh. No, yeah. really. Yeah. Eh? That's interesting. This one, this one, like it, you know, my little eyes, it peels them right open. So I, I love it. I love it so much. And it's funny. You know what? That is sort of, that's you, you, you you're, you're like the Vancouver snobby. Uh, okay. That's us. You, you'd be like, a, the, you'd be like those little millennials running around the city. There goes Phil. Well, I All am a millennial about his little wannabe. coffee. I am a millennial wannabe. Um, <laughs> Looks good, man. And then she took, she took all of these shots and then she took uh, white backgrounds too. So let me look at that. Looks that such hot. a great shot. Yeah. Um, but all of those are, yeah. So what we need to do is I, I've got to get you the passcode. Now the problem is, is that's two step verification shit. Oh, right. So when that's, you guys, when you're going to go okay. on, you're going to have to tell me you're going on. And that's, then I guess hey, this is my nest, eh? So, so not to like, but I put in a, a video doorbell for me from Nest. At so the house? That's, that's my front yard. Um, that's, that's my walkway and that's my I my like crop. that thing, you know? Yeah. Yeah. It's freaking amazing. Anyway. Did you put uh, it in yourself? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It took, uh, took me longer to figure out which power switch was for the doorbell because it wasn't marked on my power panel. And then uh, I think I had the thing up and running in about 20 minutes. So. Oh, it's not that bad. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh. But uh, yeah, so awesome. anyway, so nice these are all your coffee nice pictures. pictures. So nice pictures. We've, we've got them up and, cool. uh, or well, I've got them now. So, so we'll, I'm going to get her to do a whole bunch more since she already has the coffee. Yeah. Um, and then we'll, we'll get her to, um, you know, so that we can share them through socials and, you know, like, so you kind of got yeah. like a lot of, you know, cause now that she's got the product, we'll get her to shoot a ton of stuff and then, and then I'll, I'll figure out uh, okay. what I owe her and all that kind of stuff. So yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Very cool. Very cool. Yeah. All right. That's the end of this commerce life. We'll be back soon with the next episode. Thank you for joining us. We hope you enjoyed it. Uh, give us feedback. Tell us what you think. Subscribe, like us, join us, share us, tell your friends about us. And uh, we hope to see you next time with, uh, with more commerce news.